HD vinyl records? No, this isn't an April Fool's joke. This is real news that's come out of the vinyl world and everyone is freaking out. In this video, I'm gonna talk about my thoughts on it and fill you in if you don't know what's possibly gonna happen next year to the vinyl community. Before we get started with this video, just want to make sure you're subscribed to this channel. If you like vinyl, if you like music, on the bottom right of this video, you can go and click the little button and it'll subscribe you. Make sure you have the bell turned on for notifications so you don't miss any awesome hauls or cool vinyl videos that I put out. All right, let's get started with the news. In 2016, a European patent was filed that would provide a new way to cut records. Leading the charge is an Austrian company called Rebeat Digital. Basically, to create these HD vinyl records is going to be using 3D topographical mapping as well as laser technology. Supposedly, this process would cut manufacturing costs by 50% and time it takes to manufacture by 60%. Furthermore, it would be better for the environment by avoiding all the chemicals that are used in modern vinyl production. Sounds like a win-win. Not only is the process gonna be better, but the product is supposed to be better as well. They claim these records will have 30% more playing time and double the fidelity. Now, the first thing you may think, because it's the first thing that I thought, what happens to all of my old records? Do I need to buy a brand new HD turntable? Well, the jury's still out on that one. They say that you can use all of the HD vinyl in a backwards compatible way. But some reports are saying that you will need to purchase an HD turntable in order to get the full effects of the new format. I don't like the way that sounds. Honestly, this sounds a bit like DMM, direct metal mastering, which was a technique done in the late 80s that was trying to do this last ditch effort to really revive and revitalize the vinyl format before CDs really took over. Ultimately, that didn't work out as a long lasting process, I'm worried this could be the same. Ultimately, this raises a couple interesting questions. The first is, because of this being a more digital format, doesn't that kind of defeat the whole point of vinyl to begin with? Now, that being said, a lot of records that come out these days are digitally sourced, so they do sound a bit like big CDs, and you don't really get the full vinyl experience unless it's an analog sound. I don't listen to vinyl because it sounds better. I listen to vinyl because oftentimes it sounds different, and I like the way it sounds. The analog sound is not better objectively than a digital sound. However, it's a sound that I like, and whenever there's a record that's cut analog, modern, or classic, I tend to shy towards it rather than listening to a digital counterpart. With this process, it's supposed to sound better, but that begs the question, why not just get a really high quality FLAC file and play it through a really nice sound system? What's the difference? I worry about the feasibility of this format. I'm definitely curious about it, but ultimately, will they be able to do all of the things that they're claiming when it comes to market, which as they say in this article, could come as early as next summer. I for one know I probably won't be upgrading to an HD turntable unless overwhelming response is that you must do this and it's an unbelievable sound that you couldn't even expect coming from your setup, which I don't think will be the case. I'm also skeptical because storing extra sound within the grooves and having it be backwards compatible doesn't seem like it adds up very well. There's gonna be some issue down the line there. I'm very curious to see how this story develops, how this company continues to leak more information about what exactly they're gonna be doing, what the plans are. I know that at the next Making Vinyl conference, they plan to unveil this with all of their plans. What do you think? Off the initial reports, I'd love to know exactly what your thoughts are in terms of what this means for the vinyl community, what this means for the hobby in general. Is the bubble about to burst? Is that a good thing to you? Is that a bad thing? Are we going to be overrun with reissues that are HD and regular and we're not going to know what to buy and it's just going to be a madhouse or is this going to fizzle out just as quickly as it came? I don't know. I wanted to make this video because it's a super interesting revolution that is about to happen in the vinyl world for better or for worse. And I wanna know what your thoughts are. So please leave a comment with what your thoughts are about this. I'd love to start some conversation about, you know, what this means, what this could mean, any skepticism, anything you're excited for. HD vinyl might be coming, but will it last? That is the real question. Hope to hear from you in the comments section. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please subscribe, give it a like, and I'll be doing more videos soon.